Laos Country Profile Capital, Vientiane Population, 7,169,455 Total Size, 236,800 Square Kilometers World Region or Continent, Southeast Asia Type of Government, Communist State Languages Spoken, Lao, Official, French, English, and Various Ethnic Languages Independence, July 19, 1949, from France. Religions, Buddhist 60%. Animist and other 40%. Including various Christian denominations 1.5%. Currency, KIP, LAK. The country of Laos first began to form in 1353 when the Kingdom of Lanshang took power. The name Lanshang means million elephants. The ruler was King Phanyam and his empire ruled much of Laos as well as Thailand. During this time Buddhism became the primary religion. In the late 18th century the Lanshang had collapsed and the Siamese took control of Laos. Then, in the 1800s the French arrived. In 1907 the Franco-Siamese treaty defined the boundaries of current-day Laos. Laos was occupied by the Japanese during World War II. At the end of the war, in 1945, Laos declared independence from France. However, French troops soon reoccupied the country and took control. In 1954 Laos became an independent country from France. However, war broke out internally. After many years of fighting and intervention from both the United States and the Soviet Union, Laos was ruled by an authoritarian Communist Party. Many people have fled Laos over the years including the Hmong minority. Laos is a landlocked country in Southeast Asia. A landlocked country is surrounded by land and does not have access to the open sea. The first humans are believed to have inhabited Laos since at least 8000 BC when a Neolithic culture of hunter-gatherers emerged. The Mekong River runs through Laos. At 4,350 kilometers, it is the longest river in Southeast Asia, the seventh longest in Asia, and the twelfth longest in the world. Irrawaddy dolphins, known for their bulging forehead and short beak, used to be widely found in the Mekong River in Laos. Tragically, in 2016, the WWF announced that only three dolphins were left in Laos, meaning the species was functionally extinct in Laos. Laos is still dealing with millions of unexploded bombs from these attacks. A third of the bombs dropped failed to explode on impact and have since killed or injured 20,000 people, an average of 500 victims a year. Craters from the American airstrikes are often used as fish ponds or for irrigating crops in rice fields in Laos. During the American bombardment of Laos, a system of over 450 caves located sheltered up to 23,000 people. The caves had previously been used by communist forces as shelter. Today, Laos remains one of the world's few communist states. The only others are China, Cuba, Vietnam and nominally North Korea, although technically its government doesn't refer to itself as communist. Recently, the country has begun to open up and in 2016, President Barack Obama became the first sitting U.S. president to visit Laos. The UNESCO World Heritage Site of the Plain of Jars is comprised of over 2,100 tubular-shaped stone jars that were used for funerals during the Iron Age from 500 BC to 500 AD. Every Buddhist male in Laos is expected to become a monk for at least a short period in his life. Ideally, this would be just after he finishes school but before he starts a career or marries. During this time they are known as a nairn or novices. Laos has a nationwide curfew where nearly all bars, restaurants and nightclubs are expected to close by midnight. This is more strictly enforced in the UNESCO World Heritage Site town of Luang Prabang. People in Laos greet each other by putting their hands together in a prayer-like manner known as the Nop. Laos was once known as Lanshing which translates as the land of a million elephants. Unfortunately, today there are thought to be just 800 elephants remaining, of which half are kept in captivity. Lop, the national dish of Laos Many of the standard dishes served around Laos are adaptations from Thai, Vietnamese and Chinese food. One dish that is 100% traditional Lao though is Lop, arguably the national dish of Laos, we would argue that a visit to the country simply isn't complete without trying it. Like, share and subscribe to Sidra's Lifestyle.